And one of my buddies said, hey, uh, what are you planning on doing this year for New Year? I said, well, it's March. I think we have nine months to plan. <laughs> I don't know if this is a priority right now. He said, no, you idiot. I'm talking about Persian New Year. And I said, what? Well, we celebrate New Year's January 1, and the Chinese New Year was earlier in the month. So now it's time to celebrate the Persian New Year. What is the name of the holiday? No Ruz. No Ruz. Mm -hmm. How do you spell that? It's many spellings, but N O W R. O-O-Z is okay. one way. All right, and what mm -hmm. happens on Nehru's? Is there a mattress sale? <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's back it up and get ready for the quickest history lesson ever. Nehru's is a holiday that roots back to an ancient religion, Zoroastrianism. It's celebrated at the spring equinox, usually around March 21st, and it doesn't matter if it's midnight or four in the morning, Persians will party at that exact moment to ring in the new year. Nowruz is a festival that has been celebrated for thousands of years by Persian, Kurdish, Central Asian, and Ismaili communities. Nowruz marks the first day of spring and the beginning of the new year in the Persian calendar. It is an occasion for friends and family to come together and celebrate over the half scene table to exchange gifts and enjoy delicious delicacies. Persian New Year has some traditions which I think everybody should do even if you're not Persian. So today, we're all gonna be Persian. Step one for Persian New Year, cleaning. You are supposed to clean your whole house during Persian New Year. Um, this is the centerpiece of the Persian New Year. This is what we call the half scene table. And I wanna know what does that mean and what needs to be set out on this table to do it just right. So half seen, half to mean seven, seen is uh, the Persian uh, letter S, basically, oh, in the uh, Persian alphabet. And so on this uh, setup, we've got seven items uh, that begin with the letter uh, S, and each represent different things. Sabze, sprouted wheatgrass. It's a symbol of rebirth and renewal of nature. Samanu, wheat pudding, represents fertility and the sweetness of life. Senjed, this is for love and affection. Serke, this is vinegar and it symbolizes patience and age. Seeb, apples, these are a symbol of health and beauty. Sir, garlic, this is for good health. Somar, crush spice of berries, symbolizes the sunrise and the spice of life. That mirror there, it symbolizes the sky and self-reflection. And the goldfish and bowl of water represent movement and life. The candles bring light to the half scene and for fertility, eggs are painted. For wealth and prosperity, people will often include some coins. After that, you're supposed to go visit your elders in order of oldest to youngest. Then you're supposed to eat a lot, dance a lot, party a lot. Hi, 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 hello, hi. Hi, hello, hi, 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 hello, hi, hi. That's how we say hi. Alicia, hour and a half of bowing. Every time we see each other, hi, hello, hi, 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 hello, hi, hi, hi. It's the Iranian New Year's party, so it's, it's huge. Iranians do it big. That's how we do it. much everything that we celebrate in America over the year, we do it all in two weeks. And so it's the beginning of like the best holiday ever. I'll tell you, like, like it's New Year, so it's like New Year's Eve. Yeah. Uh, we give gifts, so it's like Christmas. For instance, one of the characters of Persian New Year, or Nowruz as it's called, is a guy that has a gray beard. He brings candy and gifts to the children that behave. His name is Amu Nowruz, or Uncle New Year. Does that sound like anyone we kind of already know? Well, that's Amu Nowruz, and well, that's the guy we're familiar with, Old Saint Nick. So uh, if this was Us Weekly magazine, we'd say, who wore it best? <laughs> I don't know who wore it best, but I do know who wore it first. Amu Nowruz predates Santa Claus by 3,000 years. Okay, okay. Right. No, you gotta do, come on. This is the first time I've ever really had 
a group of Persian friends in my life. And there's just like beautiful, inclusive aspects to the culture. Keep in line. Keep in line. Keep in line. We're like, if you're one of us, we love you from the get go. And I'm almost feeling like I'm kind of gaining brothers, best friends, family. Like, it really feels great. Interesting, because you see, like, the way uh, in America, we've kind of like put it all, we've taken these traditions yeah. and we've put it on steroids. So what I'm trying, like for example, like the gifts that we give in, in the Persian New Year, yeah. uh, my father, uh, when I was a kid, would sign a $2 bill and give it to me and say, here you go, son, Happy New Year. Um, in America, you get bikes and video games and all kinds of stuff. Uh, we color eggs, so it's like Easter. The next thing you'll find when you go to a Persian New Year event is grass on a table when you walk in and then a painted egg next to the grass. The grass represents rebirth. The painted egg represents fertility of the spring new year. Uh, does that sound like anything we might have heard of? Yeah, Easter. It predates Easter by about 3,000 years. It's actually like Iranians have it down pat when it comes to how to celebrate. It really is just like a fantastic 13-day celebration. You get gifts, you celebrate with family, you have fantastic food, and it's like a really cool unifying moment. So uh, no Christmas. So no Christmas for you. No, well, we do Christmas too now. Oh, oh that's good. <laughs> I, I, get might a throw, I might throw some Noruz in there just so I don't get ripped off. I might throw some Noruz in there just so I don't get ripped off. I might throw some Noruz in there just so I don't get ripped off. What am I supposed to say on Nauru's to everybody who's celebrating in Persian? Eidatun Mubarak. Pardon? Eidatun Mubarak. Eidatun Mubarak. Very nice. <laughs> Nauruzatan Piruz. Eidashomab Mubarak. Nauruzatan Mubarak. It's a beautiful time, so Eidashomab Mubarak or Happy Nauru's. Happy Nauru's. Wait, wait, wait. What? Um, Nauru's Mubarak. Oh, good job, Raul. Haruzetan Noruz, Noruzetan Piruz. Noruzetan Piruz. Naruz Mubarak. Noruz Piruz. Noruz Mubarak.